Hey, what's going on, Swifters? It's Teresa here, and I'm playing a different game today. I'm playing Flight Control HD. Now, if you don't know what this game is, it's sort of, um... I don't really know how to describe it. I guess it's an action game or something. I don't know. I have it on Steam, and I used to play it on my iPod uh, with my girlfriend a lot. But it is on Steam now, and I think it's like $4.99 maybe right now. I don't know. I got it on sale a couple weeks ago. And uh, what we're going to be doing is going through uh, at least one or two of the levels. We'll see. Uh, my <laughs> high score, I'm going to be a kid here for a second. <laughs> my high score on this level is 69. We're going to go to the next one. And um, I'm going to show you guys how to how to play. Now, this one is hard because uh, it's a small aircraft carrier. And what you have to do is you have to land the pink planes on the pink runways. You have to land the helicopters on the green pads. And the yellow planes need to land on the yellow runways. And you basically try and rack up as many airplanes as you can in a row. You just, you have to try and land them. So this is going to be really close. Woo! Alright, so we've landed a total of three up here. <clears throat> and this is going to be just a pretty chill chill recording here. I'm not, uh, it's not really a high intensity type of a game. Um, let's do this. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Woo! It gets really crazy though. Like, really crazy once you keep going for a while and there's like a poop ton of planes uh oh let's do this see like right now it's getting really intense like already and it's making me nervous oh snap it does alert you oh no oh no I didn't even see those dang it <laughs> I told you this one is really hard I right, hear. Let's go back to the menu. Please enjoy this refreshing beverage. Thank you. Yum yum. All right. Uh, let's try another one. What is this one? No, I want to do this one. Oh, I need to land. How many more? Nineteen. All right. I'll go do the default one. I don't think I'll beat sixty-nine, but don't show this message again. Wait. Shift. Hold on. Use the trackpad. To position the cursor over an aircraft and click shift. Oh, I don't know. I'll leave that on though. Alright. Here we go. And I think I can speed it up. Yeah, for right now. I can, you can speed it up until they are about to crash and then it slows it down again for you. And I don't believe that this has multiplayer support for Steam. It does on the... Um, it does on the i on the iPad, the iPhone, and the iPod Touch. I know that much. It's really cool. You have like a, your screen is here, and then your partner's screen is somewhere off on their screen. But then you can like send them if you're linked up. You can send them um, your airplanes that way. Like you'll only have maybe yellow on your side, and they'll have you know blue and pink. And you got to send all the blue and pink things over there, and then it comes in on their screen. It's pretty cool. It's pretty fun. My girlfriend and I used to do that. We used to play that game together. Oh no! But this one, this this map is a little bit easier. Um, and the pink planes do they do go at different speeds? So like the really big, the really big pink ones travel faster than the smaller ones. So it's for someone like me who has ADD, it's a fun game. Because uh, you have to be focusing on a lot of things. But as you saw in the last game, I didn't really do that well. So, oh, sweet. Got an achievement. All right, come on. Wait for this to clear out. Whoa. Let's go this way. There we go. And yeah, basically on the uh, on the iOS uh, devices, you just you know click and drag, which is nice. It's fun. It was kind of cool. I was kind of glad seeing this come to Steam because um, I really like this game. It's a really chill game. I used to play it a lot, like, just when I was just relaxing and hanging out. Whoa. Come on, we might, we might, we're doing okay, we're doing okay. Uh, 
Oh, jeez. Sometimes you have to redirect them backwards and stuff like that. But of course they come in from all angles, so it's like... It's really hard. And the song will get stuck in your head, I'm just warning you. Like those of you that might ask for more more episodes of this or something, I don't know if I'll give them, but uh, my guess is that you'll probably just want to hear the song again. Alright, so now it's starting to get a little bit crazy. I'm going to pull some of these guys out. Circle them back around. Whoa! Alright, there we go. Speed that up a little bit. Yikes. Oh no! Whoa! That was close. There's constant beeping this late in the game because... Um, everything is like about to crash. <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. All right, hold on. Let's circle these guys around. We are gonna, whoa, whoa. As I said, we are gonna probably beat our high score if I can keep this. Oh my goodness. Wee. No, no, we did, we did. We got 70. Oh my gosh. And this one was over here. It was crazy because I didn't even hardly see that guy coming in. So, wow. Please enjoy this refreshing beverage. Yay. Oh, we beat the high score. We got 70. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. All right, am I, am I unable to unlock this one now? New maps are available. Yes. All right. Well, I'm going to save this one for next time. If you guys want some more of this, uh, leave me a comment and a thumbs up on this video. Uh, I really want to see if you guys want more of it. If you don't really want more of it, then that's fine. But uh, leave some thumbs up and stuff, and I'll... Um, I'll, uh, I'll try and do some more of this for you guys, but uh, check that out. We beat our high score by one. That's fantastic. All right, you guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. Once again, my name is Tony Swift, and I will talk to you guys later. Peace.